Escape Games level with... Other than Mason? Mason. Mason. I can say my <laughs> no, name. No, 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 That's no. the one thing I can do right now. Right? <laughs> okay. That and eat food. Delicious. Anyways, we are here at Locked Inside, Melbourne, Florida, and we just played Psycho! It's awesome! With Psycho! Psycho? No, Psycho. <laughs> but we went ahead and we played, we heard it was the hardest game they have here, and we came from some of, with our skate buddy friends from another area, were really good, and apparently, and apparently one of them was a huge wuss on anything that's scary, which made the game so much better. Um, so the story of Psycho is that we're doctor. coming into an area, and there's a doctor. Who looking for the new... New patient, and he wants to do horrible things to us. Um, in your brain. In the brain, not in other parts of the body, but depending <laughs> on where your mind is. It would have been so. Yes. And you, you see a gruesome scene develop uh, through the video at the beginning of the game, which kind of puts you in the mode of, oh crap, I don't want that to happen to any of my orifices. Right. Yes. Any of my orifices. But, so, you plunge right in, and how did you think the scene went? So, overall, what did you feel? Oh, like? I love it. The aggression is good. Mm -hmm. Fun was alright, like in right mode. Mm -hmm. I thought the scenic was was solid. Um, like for me, it was first psycho room, psycho. I don't know anything of what Malone just said. <laughs> I'm sure it was endearing and charming and filled with knowledge and experience beyond. I said that this was first kind of this room for me. Oh, oh okay. Oh, okay. All right. Casey, right. yes, I understand that. Mm -hmm. you know. Yeah. Oh, I live here. Bring Casey with me. So, I understand. Nonetheless, okay. this was Alona's first <laughs> kind of psych award, which actually it was mine as well. So, um, so we came in. And we, I think we said, we didn't see, set the first place record, but I think we did pretty good in our yeah. group. But that's not fair because these people are really good play them. Um, the scenic, as far as the scenic goes, uh, there was, you know, I was kind of coming in thinking the scenic would be, um, you know, tile floors, so on and so forth, like that. But then again, I've never really played a game like this. All right. What you actually start off with is kind of you get a fireplace, as you see, this is the first room. Um, you get some bloody. Oh, that was right. her fault. She yeah, broke that. Yeah, Casey, she paid for that. By the way, during the game, she's breaking all kinds of stuff. <laughs> we're basically we're, <laughs> we're looking for things. <laughs> really? like, Does that look like it can be broken? Yes, it can be broken. That is how Lona solves problems. In fact, the last five minutes of the game was trying to deal with something that she had already broken that we needed to get out. That was how the games went. Yeah, but nonetheless, so that's how you get out of the room because I to break parents. things. <laughs> just a lot of ninety-seven percent of the escapes is her just breaking enough crap to get out of the room, and they're like, "Please, just leave, please." <laughs> that's usually how it works out. But nonetheless, the scenic kind of moved through. Uh, you do feel like you are in a crazy doctor's lab. Doctor, that's right. I, you know. Can't mention which room, but there's one room that I really liked that I definitely puts you into the mode. I know which one. I know which one. Yeah. So, anyway. Um, this but, single run? What's that? Single run. I don't know what language you're speaking again. Oh my but I'm, god. I do know, but I'm trying to see. Oh if we right. did that it was right here, but it's not there. More so like this, <laughs> not there. Anyways. <laughs> bear with me, people. All right. What did you, how did you think the puzzles were? It's good. It's good? Yeah. It's really good, so. Group is a big, like, big group, it's alright. Yeah, we. Like you can speak right. right. I think the puzzle started off, and <laughs> we actually spun wheels for about nine minutes, which means in American, when we're done for a little bit, we couldn't figure out the problem. I don't know why I did this in a southern accent. When you came back from Tennessee, maybe it's just that. It, it kind of rubbed on me. Um, yeah, his accent, but anyway. Um, we spun wheels for a little bit, not noticing the most obvious thing we should have done. Um, and it started to pick up a little bit from there. It moved pretty readily as we kept going. Um, once we get into the second room, which isn't okay, so much. Okay, you can talk right now how much room is here? No, we can send the second room because it's pretty obvious that there's this. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Would you crawl through the fireplace to get. No. Um, 
But nonetheless, yes. once you get to the second room, your group, your group kind of can kind of, um, if you have a bigger group, kind of attack different fronts right. at the same time. And that's what we did, and that's what worked out pretty well for us. Um, there is live attendance in this game, which if you're ready for a go, 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 go puzzle flow, which usually is kind of what we end up doing, yeah, um, it doesn't work here. Like, um, because you need to interact with the attendant, and there's a little bit of give and take, uh, literally, um, on how that actual process goes. And sometimes you need to give a little bit of time on that. Right. But it's cool because one of the things I really liked about this, which I don't think you saw, but it's okay with English, you probably read it anyway. Anyway, it was a, <laughs> it was a little um, pamphlet, that, or kind of like a little pack of papers that basically said, this is patient zero, I'm attendant. And they gave a backstory. They didn't mean to do that, but they wanted to do that to kind of put you in the theme a little bit more, to tell you who you're interacting with and how far crazy she is. That's the look of murder, and you're gonna, I can see that. But I've got a candle set. Why don't I the candles you stole from me? Whatever. I just, Anyways. Um, <laughs> so, but yeah, like the puzzles flowed pretty well. Um, they, they did, I, I will tell you this, they stumped us. They weren't, they weren't the easiest puzzles we've done. Um, it, right. We we cheated because we had so many people here, and they were good at doing what they're doing. So yeah. Um, but that being said, overall, did you have a good time? Yes. Yeah, you had a good time. Oh, yeah. I like the actors. Stupid. Yeah, she took away something else. Yes. Yes. She, like she talked with a lover. <laughs> what did she say to you? Please oh, don't I, break I, my room. I, and you're like, ha ha! Never mind. <laughs> I can tell you, we have boy in <laughs> So, anyways, um, Psycho, Locked Inside, Melbourne. Alona, Mason. Mason.